What's up people we are back with more of WAS or was the hourglass of Lepidoptera in the previous video we found out that apparently us which is Tadayoshi Kurokawa is dead so our funeral is being held today and we're trying to walk back to our mansion guided by this beautiful nurse Rosary so yeah let's see what's gonna happen Wow What's this? It's so cool! I learned of the slums through books and pictures. The scenery is almost identical to the pictures I've seen, but it seems so different in person. Hey, I understand that you're in high spirits, but stop wandering around. Uh, I know, but everything that I see and feel is unknown to me. I'm getting excited with all of these new sensations. Woof woof! Hey, Rosary! Is that barking thing a dog? Oh my god, this guy has lived such a sheltered life. He doesn't even know what a dog is. A stray dog. It'll be seriously bad if it bites you. So you'd better stay away from it. What? Stray dog? I quickly tried to hide behind Rosary as I remember something. Hmm? What's wrong, Tadayoshi-kun? Say, you're afraid of stray dogs? R r r r r rosary aren't you afraid? It's that stray dog! If it bites you, you will die, you know? Another thing I'd read once, untamed dogs usually carry viruses. If one bites you, the virus will enter your body, resulting in death. I don't think it's immediate, but rather over time you know that can happen sometimes but that one looks fine because it's not scared of water scared of water the dog was barking at me at first but I noticed that now it's playing in a fountain nearby I don't know the details but I was told to be careful with dogs that fear water oh I see is that some sort of survival knowledge from a local resident? That's some none knowledge right there. Seems like there are still many things I don't know about. Yeah, there's a lot, dude. <laughs> oh my god. You can only learn so much from books, you know? Being book smart is one thing, but you actually have to experience a lot of things yourself as well. Which is where, where you're leading this rich life and don't ha even have to lift a finger for yourself to do anything. That's kind of a bad thing in that regard. Um, well, it's still not good if it bites you, so we'd better get out of here. Yeah, it would be painful. Has this guy ever felt pain? I doubt it. Rosary walks past the dog as if it's not a threat. Don't follow me, please. I beg the dog silently and resume walking, staying close to Rosary. Tareyoshi-kun, the place ahead is more unsafe compared to the other parts of the slums, so don't wander away from me. Oh, Tareyoshi-kun, where did you go? Oh no, why did we have to run off? Ah, <sighs> you're too fast. Wait for me. I've been walking for an hour. My legs hurt so much and I'm out of breath. In contrast, Rosary's still walking, and she's far ahead of me. <sighs> hey, I need a break. I complain, but I'm pushing my weary self to walk, so as not to lose sight of Rosary. Is this the center of the slums or something? I see more and more people around. Hey, boy! You wanna have some good fun with me? Oh, it's a girl. <laughs> it's a female slum dweller. Huh? Who are you? Most of the people in the slums were looking at me as if they were evaluating my worth. One of them, a woman, is talking to me. I'm curious what fun you're talking about. But I'm in a hurry. Ask someone else, okay? <laughs> you're a naive boy, aren't you? From your nice appearance, I'm guessing you're a noble son who's lost his way. The woman clings to me persistently. Jeez, I've got no such time for th such things. 
Hey you, quit bothering him. He looks uncomfortable. Now, you pretty looking boy. How about an iced tea at my house? What? <laughs> They're all trying to kidnap me. I don't know, but I think I will lose something important if I go with him, like your life. Now I'm in a mess. I'm losing rosary while they're nagging me. Hey, what's your business with my friend? Oh, rosary, rosary to the rescue. Dun, dun, dun. I thought I lost her, but it appears the rosary came back for me. Damn, a nun. So he's an orphan. Ain't worth the trouble. He's with a girl? Whatever then. When Rosary arrives, the people leave, grumbling. Impressive. She's a reliable nun. Tadayoshi-kun, this place is more, uh, has more dangerous people than any other part of the slums. Stay with me, alright? But, but Rosary, you left me behind because you walk so fast, didn't you? Ah, I didn't expect you to be so weak since you're a boy. Uh, yeah, but you're way better than me. G girls are supposed to be de uh, delicate and have to be protected by men, I thought. Yeah, in this way it's kind of the other way around. <laughs> in many, many foreign stories, the men save the women. There's a story of a plumber with a nice mustache saving the princess from a fire-breathing beast in every chapter. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's talking about Mario. But that's a story for another time. Tadayoshi-kun! Rumble. Ah! Rosary's face turns red in anger. She looks dreadful despite her smiling. <laughs> Are you implying that I'm not very girlish? N no, I didn't. Yeah, didn't mean that at all. I'm a girl, dreaming of meeting my prince someday. Well, here I am. Probably not. We're like the weakest human being on earth. But in Rosary's case, I think she'll be keeping her prince on a leash. What did you say? I want to hear! Rumble! Rosary! You frighten me so much! Do my thoughts show up that ob uh, obviously on my face? I'm sorry! I just apologize to her. Hmm. It's too late! With puffed cheeks, she starts to walk away. I beg your pardon! Please don't leave me! Please! Please! I follow Rosary in a hurry. Today's lesson, do not ever make Rosary mad. Yeah, that seems like a good life lesson. Especially if you're dependent on that person, on Rosary. <sighs> hey, how long do we have to walk? Well, about an hour, I think. If we took too much time, your funeral would be over. We have to hurry. Eek! Seriously? I'm pushing myself so hard just to walk, but Rosary's still looking fine. Isn't this something like a woman's mind is a weather van? Weather vane? I've never heard of that word. One hour later, I realize Rosary's no longer mad at me. Even the children in the church can walk this far without breaking a sweat. Keep it up. I recall seeing a bunch of noisy children or kids when I left the church. It seems Rosary doesn't live in that old church by herself. <sighs> yeah, I can't be losing to those kids. I've lost count of my steps by now, but I keep forcing my tired body to pick up the pace. I've got a feeling that harsher challenges are going to appear, ones that I have never experienced before. I can't let them beat me here. His eyes were so dull a while ago. Foo-hoo! Trying hard not to lose? Yes, that's the spirit for a boy! She pats my head while she's saying this. Oh yeah, we like it when she pats our head. I want I want her to stop treating me like a child. Yeah, right. What? What? I was about to retort to Rosary, 
but a child's cry interrupted me. Oh, you fell over? It hurts, it hurts. Wow, worst kid's voice ever. <laughs> I realize that I'm so bad at doing others' voices, but whatever, we're gonna roll with it. Is that a nun's nature? As soon as I hear a child crying, Rosary's already going to him. Oh, it's not bleeding much, so you should be okay. Rosary smiles at him, holding her clean looking handkerchief against the wound. I'll kiss it and make it better. Uh, it's like a freaking baby. <laughs> Now the pain's gone. You're a good boy. You'll be okay. Understand? Yes. Thanks, lady. After Rosary consoles him, the child stops crying and runs away. I wanted her to stop treating me like a child. But I think that crying child and her are the same to her. Yeah, we actually are. Rosary. I think you'll become a good mother. Mother? Hmm. For a moment, I see a deep sadness on her face. Oh no, did we say the wrong thing? I'm sorry, Rosary. Now, we're almost there. We've got to hurry or we won't make it. But it disappears the next second. She starts walking again, her demeanor restored. Yeah. We must hurry. Huh? Isn't that Rosary? And that boy with her isn't familiar to me. Who is he? Oh well, it's nothing to do with me. Who was that? Is that Rosary? In her pajamas? No. <laughs> that was her nun uniform. It just kind of looks less like it because of the color. Because with nuns, you always generally just think like, yeah, everything that they wear is black. Uh, black and some white here and there, as you can see. We're here, Tadayoshi-kun. Seems you made it in time. Dang, look at this gate. And we're not even talking about the huge-ass mansion behind it. The gate alone has like golden stuff on it. Holy crap. <sighs> I feel like we walked three hours or more just to get here. I can't take it. I'm gonna vomit. Well, we should rest a bit before going to the mansion. Uh, yeah, I'm still fine. But if you insist, uh, let's take a break. Oh, how thoughtful you are. Uh, yeah, I am. Ah, a gentleman that would embarrass the British. Nothing special. Uh huh. Good, good. I get the feeling she's mocking me. Here, have a drink of water. <laughs> For some reason, when I see this face of Rosary, it's actually kind of scary. Cause she has those big eyes, and she's sort of like smiling, but not smiling with teeth. And there's only like one little point of her that's. Apparently her nose, I think. I don't know, something about it when I just look in her eyes deeply, it's quite scary. Thanks! I empty the small water bottle Rosary gives me in one go. Not even willing to share. The water spreads throughout my tired body. Now, after a break, I took a look around. I, don't, uh, I didn't think about it before. When I look at the mansion from the outside, it hits me just what a big place I live in. Just like everyone says, it's a big mansion, isn't it? Yeah, it's easy to lose your way inside if you wander around. I've always had servants with me when I had to walk, so I've never gotten lost in a mansion. Oh my god, this guy. <laughs> Funeral hall for the Kurokawa family. A guide board with black frames shows that the funeral is indeed being held. To the public, being a likely successor, my death has a big influence on Kurokawa Saibatsu. Even though I've been shunned by the family behind the scenes, 
they would never pull a prank like this. So my dead body should be in the funeral hall. It appears that nobody is causing a commotion. The body in the funeral hall should be identical to me. Tara Yoshikun, what are you going to do? Rosary looks into my face with concern. I've got no choice. I'll go into the mansion and prove that I'm still alive. What if this is a conspiracy against me? The culprit left me in the slums and thinks that the slum dwellers did the rest of his dirty work. And I think he doesn't expect me to return to this place alive. I try to approach the mansion. The gate is closed. There are two guards standing near the gate. Since it's a funeral for a scion of Karo uh, Kurokawa Saibatsu, lots of VIPs are here. So the security is going to be really high. Not even a cat can get in. I think I know those two. Maybe I saw them before when I lived here. That makes this easy. They would be surprised to see me alive, but they should let me in. Hey, you there! Open the gate for me, now! Huh? Who's this arrogant brat? I don't know, maybe a slum kid trying to steal something. What are they talking about? Oh no, has our appearance changed? They work for Kurokawa, and don't know my face? I don't think that's possible. Well... What is this funeral all about? None of your business. You'd better go home now. What a bunch of fools for not knowing the son of your master. I am Tadayoshi Kurokawa. And why is my funeral being held despite me being alive? What? Upon hearing my words, the gu uh, guard's eyes widen and they glance at each other. Boy, what are you saying? It's unlikely we don't know the face of our master's son. Come up with a better story if you're going to lie to us. Tadayoshi-sama is a grown-up. Yeah, he's not a little young, uh, young little bugger like you. Did they say I'm a grown-up? I'm still 16 years old. Who are they talking about? Oh no. So this is apparently in the future. I think it's safe to assume that. Are you guys out of your mind? Tadayoshi Kurokawa's already a grown-up? What a joke! Anyways, you guys are just goons. Let me pass. Enough. We don't have time to deal with a kid like you. A guard grabs me and starts dragging me away from the gates. Let me go! Don't you know what's going to happen if you do this to me? I struggled, but couldn't do anything against his well-trained muscles. Lifted up by the guard, I couldn't let my feet on the ground. Get lost! Thump. He throws me away, violently, treating me like trash. Ouch! You! No! When I try to run back to the gate, Rosary stops me. Rosary's eyes are wet, and tears are about to flow. Oh no, don't cry, Rosary. Rosary! Why are you stopping me? Please, I know how you feel, but you must fall back. She's so desperate not to let me go. Oh, I just got a glimpse, but one of the guards has a gun, and it's aimed at me. Oh my god, that's drastic measures against freaking against against the slum kid. They're just like, yep, okay, let's pull out my gun. Oh my god. Are slum children that big of an issue here? It doesn't seem like they're going to hesitate to shoot me if I keep going. I know Kurokawa Saibatsu has many enemies. Even if it's a kid, they'll have to dispose of anyone trying to harm Kurokawa. I bet Rosary stopped me because she saw the gun. Damn it! I'm not convinced, but I can not drag Rosary into danger with me. Not only am I dead, but I am a grown-up too. None of this makes any sense at all. I want to cry out loud, but I bite my lip to hold it in. I take the road back to the church with heavy steps. Oh, 
Oh. Dang, those intros are always freaking awesome. But yeah, we're gonna end the video here. I think it's safe to assume that strange things are already happening, considering the fact that we are, we are apparently, or Tadayoshi, in his 16-year-old body rather than in what in the current or in this world is happening is that he's actually a grown-up. So for some reason, he's in his younger body? Don't know why, but we'll have to find out in the next video. So thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace!